So what do you think we take a look at some Revtown jeans today? No, I'm not giving you the middle finger, this is just how I point. All right, so let's just do a normal unboxing like we normally do. So, uh, ignore the ripped label. That is so you don't know where I live, uh, because yeah. All right, so Revtown jeans, here we go. Boom, nice packaging. Uh, you can tell already it's pretty nice. Uh, these um, are the uh, steel gray denim jeans in a size 32, 32. Uh, before I unpackage them and kind of show you a quick walk around of what they look like, let's hit a couple of items that have to do with the company because uh, I'm super impressed with the company and the actual price on their uh, attire that they have uh, at Revtown. So, little background. Uh, two of the founders worked at Under Armour uh, for almost a decade uh, as leaders of their product and, and brand. And so they've been around the um, athletic design and apparel game for quite some time. So they decided to um, head to Italy and work with some of the designers in fashion as well as some uh, and try to bring an athletic um, and fashion design to jeans. And so their motto is really make the best jeans, right? That's their goal is to make the best jeans. Um, they have a patented four-way dynamic stretch uh, that they say is constructed with the strongest fibers in uh, apparel design today. Uh, again, this is a Italian mill denim. Uh, what I like about uh, what they've done as a company is they have um, taken a sustainable model to um, their build in their textiles and um, they actually dye uh, in a sustainable manner that's 70% less chemicals than what is used in traditional techniques, which is uh, I can get down with. Um, they also, 100% of all waste, so as they actually make the jeans, any of the waste is recycled into denim yarn to be used for other uh, pieces of apparel. And uh, if not that, then they'll use it in uh, insulation for local housing. If you've seen um, denim insulation, it's pretty, it actually insulates pretty well in, in housing, uh, not, not too bad. So a lot of uses, I like the sustainable model that they have within their company. I like uh, their motto. They are headquartered in Pittsburgh, PA. Um, they state that their jeans are insanely comfortable and um, I'm kind of excited to to try them out. So I've had my eyes kind of on this company for a while. Uh, I listened to the Joe Rogan podcast. That's why I originally heard from the company. So after, you know, hearing him and his advertisement of the jeans, I went to take a look at them and uh, kind of liked their style. Um, as well as a lot of things with the, the company themselves. So these are their steel gray um, color, colorway. Um, their jeans are all $79 um, currently at the time of uh, this video. And they come in three different sizes. So taper, which is a skinny fit, uh, shark, which is a slim fit, and automatic, which is a straight fit. So these are automatic, um, size 32, 32. So I am, as of today, 190 pounds. Um, which fluctuates uh, plus or minus two or three pounds here or there. Um, and I am six foot two. So 32, 32, um, I will let you know how well they actually fit. Based on that, I have plenty of jeans in a slim fit. These are more of a straight fit, their automatic is. Um, so I start out with them and kind of see if I wanna tailor them or return them for a little bit more of a, of a slim fit. But uh, I usually typically start with a straight fit and then not knowing exactly how a jean is gonna fit or a pair of pants are gonna fit. So uh, the company also offers a khaki pants. Um, they also offer uh, quite a variety of different shirts from polos to Henleys to um, V-necks and uh, crewnecks. And they're, um, I think most of their shirts are made in a uh, Pima cotton if I remember correctly, which is super comfortable. Um, I actually ordered one of their polos uh, to try one of those out also, so I can uh, give you all some feedback on that as well. Uh, additionally, they um, they launched in 2018, and since then they now have a, a women's line of clothing too. So again, kind of excited to try these out. Um, you know, I, uh, 
I like to try out different different things and uh, different brands. You, you all know that I'm a huge fan of Bluffworks, and uh, so I'm hoping to kind of you know really kind of get some similar experience here with Revton. So I'll pop these out of the um, plastic, kind of hang them up, give you kind of a quick walkthrough of what they look like hanging up. Maybe I'll try them on and kind of show you what their fit is actually like from a uh, um, standpoint of the automatic fit. That's kind of cool underneath, you know, best fitting, most comfortable pants in your closet should be a pair of jeans. Um, and I've been kind of having to replace some denim and so I figured this was a way to go. All right, let's uh, take them out of this. I'll hang them up and we can just kind of do a quick B-roll look at what they look like. Okay, so as you can see, they're a nice, um, Nice color they have actually, they do have quite a bit of stretch to them. I can tell already just from feeling them, they're gonna have a lot of stretch in them. Nice uh, touches, right? So heat pressed labels, which are kind of nice. Uh, nice uh, button, uh, let's see what kind of zippers, if they're YKK zippers or not. Uh, doesn't look like they're YKK zippers, which would have been nice if they were a YKK zipper. Your normal standard five pockets um, on these that kind of have a nice like wear worn look on here. I will say that these are the straight fit jeans, but I can tell by the bottom of them um, they look like the at least the bottom openings. I'll give a dimension of these. Um, they look like they're more of a um, slimmer fit. So again, every brand is different in their fits. So it's always best to um, try them out. And these guys have a great return policy. Um, free shipping, I believe, on returns and exchanges. Um, I'll put a note if that's incorrect, but I believe that's the case. Um, and again, just like a simple design and pockets, which is great. Like I hate stuff that's overdone with a bunch of stuff on the pockets and a bunch of just extra things you don't need. Like simple is so much better. So um, I dig the design. Um, it's, it's actually nice. And again, these are in the steel gray. I kind of want to try these out first because I have jeans and all the normal regular colors and black jeans and all that good stuff. So. Um, so hopefully this helped you all out. Um, if you've been looking at Revtown jeans and you kind of wanted a kind of quick overview of them, um, I'll plug in a picture with them on so you can actually see the fit um, and uh, give you an idea what that looks like. Again, uh, you can refer back to my size. Hopefully it'll give you a decent reference um, for you. If you're looking for a pair of jeans, decent price. It sounds like they really back their product and um, have really done a good job in design and I like their style and simplicity um, as well as their manufacturing process and some of their um, you know conscious decisions that they make. Take a look at Revtown jeans. Um, I think I'll be buying some more from them uh, in the future. And uh, who knows, maybe they'll send me some uh, additional things to potentially give some reviews on and let you all take a look at. Um, hopefully that's the case. And again, I believe I have um, a, a polo on the way from them also to, to check that out. So, all right, thanks for sticking around.